Welcome back. We're to the Daily Habit, and today's show is huge because we have Guy Mariano and now Hank Three. I, I can't All right, you, man. We've been trying to get you on here for so long. We finally got on the big bird. <laughs> You're one, one busy guy. And if anyone was watching the Habit forming trivia, it's true. You played another band besides Hank Three, right? Uh, uh, quite a few. Yeah. But the main one uh, I played drums in is a band called Arson Anthem. Yeah. So that's uh, the old singer of Pantera, Philip Anselmo. He plays guitar in Arson Anthem, and I met Philip when I was like 15 at a show. He, I used to play uh, drums in a band called Buzzkill, and he's like, "Y'all are pretty good." So, you know, 15 years later, I'm jamming, yeah, jamming the drums with him. So. Well, it kind of speaks. I mean, being the grandson of Hank Williams and Hank Williams Sr., do you, you have that interesting mix and eclectic vibe of like the punk, the rockabilly. It, it, how does that affect when you do these shows? Because like, you have to attract so many different people. Uh, yeah. yeah, we fought for years getting the diversity in our crowds. You know, I keep saying 18 to 80 is our crowd. Yeah. The rednecks, the punks, the metal kids, the average everyday guy. And um, you'd be surprised how well everybody gets along for the pits. And some people come up and not used to getting pushed around and stuff like that. But everybody takes care of each other at the show. So. And you break it into blocks. Like by the time you get to the final one, it's kind of like the more punk stuff. The 80 year olds at that time, you know, they're in bed. Right? Uh, well, some do <laughs> stick around, yeah. you know, it'd be surprised. But it, the, out, the first hour is country, the middle part's the hellbilly, and then we end the night with uh, the more hardcore heavy metal right. ass jack. Yeah, well, with all the ass jack fans, I know that they were always aware that you were a skater from a young age. Is that. Or do you just have a local skate spot? Because you've been, what, 13, 14 years old when you started skateboarding? Uh, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, maybe a little before that, but yeah. living in Atlanta, getting turned on to the punk radio stations and the music, and, you know, uh, back in the day, the Thrasher magazines turned me on to all kinds of GBH, DOA, yeah. and Suicidal and all that, and it just, it, it just kind of fit the energy and, you know, pulling off the, the intense tricks and uh, yeah. when we were playing out live. Well, intense then. We're talking like backside bonelessness and stuff. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, kind of Jeff Grosso style. Well, you've gone all the way from that to, uh, I know this you're on your, your second, oh, let me show the original first, but uh, Ass Jack Skate Deck, right? Hank 3? Uh, yeah. Signature edition. That's the Sector 9 boards. We met Rob on the Warp Tour, Rob Molt, and uh, he's been by our side ever since, hooking us up. Uh, this graphic has a lot of things going on in it, though. It's got the ass jack and some lyrics behind it and the shield of protection yeah. and you know I went to Franklin Rebel High School so that's <laughs> you know that's what the stars and bars good, are good on times. there for. And, uh, yeah very good for frontside rock and rolls as well. Yes. And, and a signature uh, little box shoe right or they're sponsoring. Uh, yeah yep. they've, they've been helping us out for a while and they stepped up and you know gave us our own brand so we're proud on that one. And can we talk about the new album? Uh, high points, low points. I'm going to say they're all high points because uh, it's uh, you. You know, you're back to the solid. Uh, you know, the good stuff we know you for. Yeah, I mean, it, it kind of a little bit for everybody. There's you know a couple of songs for the kids in black, long hauls and close calls, and the tribute to Gigi. Then you got your so-so songs for the yeah. average people and a, a couple of straight up country yeah. songs. Does it surprise you when you come across kids at your shows, like young, young skate kids that know like GBH Exploited, but they also know about Gigi Allen and they, you know, this was before they were born? Uh, uh, yeah, they're doing their homework, you know, and you'd be surprised how many are into to Hank Williams and Johnny Cash and David Allen Coe. Yeah. And, you know, I'm just like, wow, I never would have thought that, but it's right. been happening a lot more. I love that you keep the reverence and the rock alive. You're going to set up, right? You play for us? Yes, you okay. know it. All right. Well, uh, Hank sets up. Right now, we're going to check in from the Dew Underground. Highlights from this year's final stop at the Dew Tour in Orlando. Here it is. Now, let's send things over to the Snickers soundstage. Here to perform Life of Sin, ladies and gentlemen, Hank 3. Well, I... Searching through the crowd for another drunken round Satan's in the backseat giving me a vice again Well, I need a life of sin
Welcome back, everyone, to The Daily Habit. I want to thank today's guest, Guy Mariano and Hank Three, here to take us out of the show on the Snickers Soundstage, performing Six Pack of Beer. It's Hank Three. We'll see you next time. Well, I'm working real hard. I'm not getting paid. I'm sick of this life, and i got to get a break. I've been real high. I've been down low. I live in a sack of a cut of the road. Well, I'm working real hard, and I'm getting paid. I'm sick of this life, and i got to get a break, and I just can't get by. Well, working real hard ain't hard to do When you got you a lot of money coming to you But I ain't got a dime, so I'll just sit here Even though I'm broke, I got a six-pack of beer Well, I paid my dues, I paid my rent They still try to take it, but think they can I thought I had a good thing going on But the my door and he took me on He said, hey boy, you owe the government Well, working real hard ain't to do when you got you a lot of money coming to you but I ain't got a dime so I'll just sit here even though I'm broke I got a six pack of beer Even though I'm broke, I got a six-pack.